Ooh. What? Stop rubber banding me. You will see that I have set up a fairly significant little uh, operation here. And where... Okay, so where did all the carrots go? This thing is going a little crazy. I'm gonna have to turn that off somehow. Um, eventually, they'll stop. They'll get to a point where they'll stop breeding. Uh, where are the carrots? Okay, I am um, out of carrots. Did it send it all over to here? Because I did not want you to do that. I wanted you to harvest, and I made this the the, the smaller. So this is a vacuum mode, so it should have gone into here before it went down to here because there's a there's a dense mode. And it normally, well, I, I guess I want to say it normally does that. Let's go check and see if it just threw it into the into the system. Ah, 148 carrots. Good. Um, let's grab. Two stacks of carrots, shall we? And we will put some of them. So it looks like the seeds are doing pretty well over here. And I put cobble in here just so it wouldn't overload with seeds. Um, and then, let's see, let's put you there and you there. So you should plant. And so, so here's the thing. I mean, this is a dense here, and then this is vacuum here. So it all should have just gone right over here. It should have chose to go over here first. Oh, I'll bet I know what, what happened. It cannot, because... It... There. So let's take these out. Because I don't think it needs... Yeah, it planted the ones that I had. And let's just go ahead and drop these down for the for the piggies. The piggies. There we go, piggies. Breed away. Yay! Wow, did you see that? Kablooey. Um, okay. So now, let's just see if we've got... Uh, do I have my... So I hooked up these chronotypers, um, but I haven't actually powered them up yet. Um, but I'm gonna do that with the pigus real quick and just see what happens. Oh, oh, goodbye. Goodbye, sir. Make your way over there. Do not fall off, do not fall off. Make your way. How come I can't? Come on, get over there. Oh, one fell off, didn't he? Dang. Oh, they're not one to go. Whoa! Okay. Okay, so this might not have worked out right. Why do I have a zombie pigman? Oh, because I have zombie pigmen! I have zombie pigmen. How cool is that? It's hilarious. Okay, so there's two. Come on, drop off. Do I have my... Okay, so... I need to turn this off. And, of course, you're not going to let me now, are you? So, do I have the pigs over here, or what's the deal? I think I'm going to have to go down and retrieve the pigs. This did not work out right. Because the pigs keep on wanting to get back to the mothers. Poopy. I wonder if I could... Do I have any... That's funny that I have zombie pigment in there now. Okay, so 
<laughs> I wanted to give you a status update, but I'm on with, with hazardous. <laughs> I just jumped on, and this is the conversation. He says, yellow, and then down here I'm like, hello, are you well? I am fine. Yes, how are you? That is good. I am also good, you are. <laughs> yes. Um, I didn't have to say my life had to make sense. I just had said it had to be. Okay, status update. <laughs> um, so I have started making some stuff, and what I found out was um, I need a lot of milk for stuff. Um, and I put in this tank originally, and then I changed my mind because I thought, well, I've got a cow. And what I can do with my cow, if I ever need to milk it, is I can just uh, do this. Um, take my cow in a Pokeball and go, bloop, and then milk him, and then bloop, back in. <laughs> so instant milk wherever I want to go. Um, so this will probably go away, or I'll probably use it just to get rid of it and stuff like that. Um, let's see. Come down this way. And... Uh, we will see that, oh, here I am. I'm stationed at the cash register. This is good. And voila, look at this. Isn't this cool? So I've got some two toppers, and I've got some four toppers, and I've got some just seats to sit in if I need to make a make a larger table or something like that. Oh, it's beautiful. Um, <laughs> excuse me. So uh, what I'm thinking about, oh, and I've also got some, Things already set up, so I've got some uh, juices here and some different stuff, and that's in this uh, basket. So I've got some apple juice, chocolate milkshake, and some black coffee to wake you up. And then over here, I started making some hamburgers and meat pies. So hamburger and meat pie, beef pie. Um, and then um, I found out that there's a lot of things in here that are, oh, close that door. Uh, a lot of things in here that are awfully pretty expensive to make. So um, not that I'm too worried about it. It's not like I don't have enough beef and meat and stuff like that now. But uh, yeah, they're they're pretty expensive. So it's going to take me a little while to get everything up to... Hello, C. Mason. Do Ring people up. Be good about it. Um, so it's going to take me a little... Oh, and I even put them in a little chair in here. <laughs> so... So that one, that chair is from the Furniture Mod. Uh, so um, these are from BiblioCraft. These you can sit in. This one, like whenever you click on it, it's like, unfortunately sitting is temporary disabled. Please stand by. Oh, I'm funny. Yay. Um, the kitchen is also done. I put in a um, aqueous accumulator underneath and then a fluid transposer because I was needing to get a lot of water, so I figured I better do that. I also put in a uh, refrigerator, Food Plus refrigerator. These are, uh, Mr. Cray, this is the Furniture Mod refrigerator. This I need to make um, ice chunks and ice cubes and stuff like that. So that's what that's all about. Other than that, um, that's pretty much it. I haven't done too much else over here. But I have been over at the farm, the farmhouse, getting stuff ready to go. And... Um, yeah, let's go on over there. So here is the, oh, I've got a little patch over here. Oh, I hope that's not my patch. Mm. Don't you tell me you're my patch. Oh, I think he is. How did he get out? He got out. Um, poopy. Well, he's probably gone then. <laughs> anyway, uh, what the farm has become. So I have uh, been been doing some farming and stuff. And um, obviously I haven't been over here. I may go ahead and install some some witchery uh, poppet shelves over here just to make sure everything keeps growing. Um, but I've got my, my pineapples. I've got my um, sugar cane. Tons of cocoa, and I might even plant some more cocoa. I haven't made my decision yet about this. Um, I'm thinking I might just go ahead and plant some more cocoa and be done with it. Um, yeah, so so things are coming along well. And I think, let's see here. Um, I think I'm going to set up some storage down here uh, for everything 
Um, I need to finish moving the tinker's table over to the uh, blah, 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 the, the other base. Um, and I think I might take this down next and just and then just make this a wall of, of um, you know, uh, storage just to store all the all the, the stuff that I've got. Then I also moved, you know, we used to have the 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 um thingamabob, the whatchamacallit, the, the the portal over here. I went ahead and got rid of that. Um mainly because the heck? Mason must have been over here mucking about with things. There's a copper ingot over here. What was he doing? What the heck? Okay, that all just despawned. Um, okay. No idea. That looks like it's brand new. Brand new construction in here. Brand new destruction, rather. Um, and, oh, well, hello, I'll take some of you. Uh, yeah, so not sure what he was doing. And, of course, no light, because we wouldn't want to light things up here. It's better better to have the mobs out than, than to light things up. <laughs> uh, let's see. Uh, so, has he been over here too? Looks like he's been, oh my gosh, looks like he's been, yeah, so I moved the, the portal over here, <laughs> just simply because this is a safer, you know, bottom line, it's a safer, you know, there's no way up here except by, for by ladder, so even if something got out, you know, even if something spawned in, you know, out here, it's not going to be able to get up here, which I really want. I don't want, you know, I want to make sure that this stays safe. Um, so, I guess what we'll do now is go over to the main base. And, oh, that was a nice little bit of lag. Um, okay, so, what do we have here? We have plenty, oh my gosh, look at this. I'm going to stop this. Oh, we have too much. Oh, wow. Look at this. And chickens everywhere. Okay, so um, I have more or less fixed this part here. I think that no more chickens will get out unless they start glitching through the, the covers. So I microblock covered the entire thing and made a little tunnel here. Now, here's the problem. They're still not coming out. But I'm going to assume that they're going to they're going to back up at some point and just start shooting out. Uh, in fact, let me go start breeding some more. Even and we'll continue to get this show on the road. There we go. Breed yourselves. There we go. Oh, you're all in love. We love to be in love, don't we? So, you know, as more and more of them come through, they should continue to just continue to back up and stuff. And then I think once they once they uh, grow up too, that's gonna make them come even, you know, further down and stuff. The only thing I'm worried about is when they grow up, are they still gonna fit in here? I think they'll fit in a one by one block. But we will, we're about to find out. 